Hey YouTube, welcome back. Long time no video and no talk. Sorry about that guys, obviously work has been pretty hectic, but now I have a few days off. So I am going to be doing three videos, two to three videos, depending on how I feel. Um, and they're obviously gonna be sale videos. Like I said before, I'm pretty much done with Pokemon for the time being. Um, so I'm gonna be selling everything. Everything in my collection is up for sale. Uh, the rules and the prices are gonna be in the description for pretty much, I think, two out of the three videos. If I do the third video, it's gonna be my normal one where I go through those packs and EXs and, and cards and stuff like that. So, and I'll know the price of those, so don't worry about that. But the rest of it will be in the description. I've already had those prices from before. I'm showing you what I have left, essentially. Um, so yeah, it should be two round two videos for the new stuff or the stuff that you've seen. And then the last video is gonna be the older stuff that you're probably used to, the all those packs and stuff over there and, and whatnot. So yeah, I'm trying to sell everything. Um, obviously, if you're looking for other stuff that you know I have, that you've seen in my collection, any type of set, I have pretty much all the sets there, first edition base set, all in near mint or mint condition. Um, there, there's a few sets that I've already sold, like Sky Ridge, Aquapolis, stuff like that. But I do have all the other sets, English, Japanese. So if you're looking for sets, please message me. I'm not gonna be showing them, but if you're looking for stuff in particular, it doesn't hurt to ask me if I have it um, and what I'm going to sell it for and you can buy it right then and there or you can wait a few months or a few weeks or whenever I get to making another video for me to show it. It's going to take me a long time to sell all this stuff, obviously. So uh, my prices, like I said before in the description, my rules in the description, I don't send for the same time. I only accept PayPal or USD only. I only ship uh, through bubble mailers or higher. So the cost for United States is going to be $3 starting and then $7 international starting. So depending on what you buy, the price will go up. If you're wanting tracking, that'll obviously be an extra charge. Uh, for US, it's a it starts at a dollar um, and then up. If you're wanting it to be shipped a certain way in like a party mailbox, you're gonna have to pay for that. So just let me know if you're not wanting it shipped in bubble manner, because that's my default. I'm not responsible for lost or stolen property in the mail or damaged. And also, um, I am not a PSA grader, so anything minus obviously the PSA cards. But the other stuff, um, I'm going based off of my own opinion. If your opinion is slightly different, um, I recommend if you're going for PSA gradable cards, um, I'm going to tell you right now, I am not a grader. Uh, it, you buy at your own risk. I don't do returns or exchanges, so I'll try to do my best to describe stuff, but I am not perfect, so sorry. So let's go ahead and get started. Let's go through all these awesome cool cards. You've already obviously seen the majority of these, so we'll try to go through most of them really quick. This video will be relatively quick. And depending on how quick it is, maybe I'll do another part and try to cut down on the total of videos that I'm doing. But I, I didn't want to do, I don't want to do like some crazy amount of videos. Um, yeah, but these are all the PSA cards that I own, plain and simple. It's everything I own, all of my PSA, minus one. I think I've, I said that once before, I am keeping one. Uh, and that's the one of my PSA 10 core core mute. But I'm selling the other two. The majority of these, minus the ones that were probably in my box or whatever, are in the newer cases. But it's really a mixed bag. I, I mean, you can send them back, though, um, to get them re, re put in the new ones. But I don't know how much that costs or what that entails. And to be honest, there's not too much difference when you look at them. So here's some other cool ones. Some English, Japanese stuff, more Japanese, another English one. Like I said before, prices will be in the description. If it's not here or in the description, let me know. There's one of the tens. Um, I'll do my best to uh, find the price as soon as possible. Another thing that I'll go over right now, if you're wanting to buy something, please send me a message. Don't leave me a comment. Um, and when you're replying, um, especially if it's been like over a day, please just send me a new message. Don't hit the reply button. Um, a lot of people still don't understand this. You know... For people who are selling stuff, they get a ton of messages from people. A lot of it usually spam. And your messages will go away. And what I mean by go away is they will actually go 
all the way to the bottom of the page and then you'll have to keep loading and loading and loading more. And with the new system, these are all a bunch of sevens right here, these two, and then these are all a bunch of nines and then I have a bunch of eights. Um, but it, it gets really hard to find people's messages because it gets jumbled up. You don't know who you reply to, you don't know who's messaging you. It's just the whole system really fucking sucks. It is horrible. And a lot of people are like, oh, why are you quitting or whatever? That is one of the reasons. Another reason is I just haven't really been into it too much lately, but uh, that is one of the reasons. I know some people are like, oh, that's a BS reason, but the YouTube updates have been horrid trash. So this right here is a complete PSA 10 shiny collection set. It has all the cards that you can think of right here. They're all PSA 10. If you want to actually see all of the, the cheaper ones, um, you can go to my previous video for the PSA cards. I don't want to get into having to show every single one of them, um, all the crappier ones. But here are the, the important ones that I'm sure that people are really caring about, which are the full arts. So you can see that they're 10. And then the rest of their little guys are 10 as well. Alrighty. Okay, moving on. We've got a Charizard, PSA 10. Very, very cool. Bugia 10, old school. This dinged up uh, PSA stuff. This is the old, old, old school one. So it's relatively old and uh, been through weather. Awesome, cool EV card. That is one row done. Um, obviously the shiny collection I'm keeping together. There's a few other stuff like that in here that I'm going to try to keep together, but unless if you're willing to pay a little bit more per the individual card you're looking for, and not for the shiny collection, but the other, other stuff that you'll see, um, I might let them go. Okay. Uh, I think another thing that I was going to bring up was my shipping time. I'm going to try to ship at least twice a week. So if I receive your item, I'm going to try to ship them usually on like Mondays or like Thursday or Fridays. I try to like to do it two days a week. I don't want to go totally, but I'll let you know. I've been pretty good about that, letting people know kind of when I'm going to ship their item. <laughs> Some very, very good PSA cards for sure. I really like my collection that I've created. I might take a few offers on some of them. Offers are usually welcome, but be reasonable. I'm not selling these things for people to resell. This is supposed to be going to people's collection. So think of me as just a seller. We got two more full rows and we'll be done with this video. Um, coming up next, this thing right here. I'll just put this back here. This is a full set of the McDonald's, all PSA 10. We'll go through them real quick. Very, very beautiful set. I loved collecting this set. It was a little bit harder to get the a uh, few of the cards, but I was able to obtain all of them. And the really, really hard ones were all the energies, as you can see right here. You can see all the energy names. The energies are really, really cool. That was really fun to get those PSA 10. That's why you saw some of the other ones that there were nines. I did not always get what I wanted, but that happens with PSA. It's always a risk to send stuff. Um, it's hard to see errors and stuff. So a gamble. It's like going to Vegas. You're not always going to win and get what you want. Sometimes you just got to suck it up and try to find something new, something better. That'll get you what you need. Ooh, come on. This thing fell over. you got to be kidding me. There 
you go. Alrighty. I'll put a few of these back in. And there we go. Okay. Really cool shiny Blastoise and Charizards. I had double. Actually, before I think I got like four of each, and and then I sold them. Uh, these ones I'm gonna try to send sell them as a set. But if you're wanting to buy them individually, um, I think I put the prices in there down below. But if I didn't, just message me. Um, I will sell them individually if needed. Same thing with this set, uh, the GR Rally. I'd like to sell it as a set, but if you're really wanting the individual card, message me and. I'll try to do the research and find out the cost. It's not a full PSA 10, sadly. I screwed up on a few of them, sending the wrong card. But, you know, it happens. But still, very beautiful cards, for sure. Alrighty. Let's get these other ones back into their little case. If anyone's winning this case, too, I will be selling it eventually. And for less than what you can buy it for. So stay tuned for that. And then more um, gold stars. I think this are all of my really cool gold stars. All PSA 10s. I think I might have like a 9 in here somewhere. There it is. Um, just because I couldn't get it in a 10. It's the only one I had and I wanted the full set or whatever. And yeah, I don't have those Espeon or Jap... Uh, Umbreon Japanese, those are freaking really hard. Or the first edition of the Latios, Latias, Rayquaza. I mean, I have those Latias and Latias, but they're just like excellent condition-ish. So, very hard to get those cards. But I did a pretty good job for the short time that I was doing PSA cards. So I am very, very happy with what I was able to obtain. So the last thing is a full, complete PSA 10 10th movie set. Very, very cool. This is very popular. I sold out of these all the time, and I know Pokepix did too when he was selling the PSA ones and the uh, the actual ungraded ones. I sold the ungraded ones. I would find the the, um, the sealed set or even the open one. I think I still have a few somewhere. Um, but they were, they sold back in the day like hotcakes. It was great. Um, really, really beautiful set. Very well done. Uh, it was distributed pretty nicely as well. So. so guys, that's all of my PSA cards. So if you're interested in any of them, please send me a message. Stay tuned for part two. I'll be showing all of my binders that I was going to show um, with the, you know, the EXs from English, Japanese, what I had left over. I sold quite a bit. So we'll go over those next. And then we'll for the final video, we'll go through the, the packs and, and some of the other stuff that you usually see in my my sale videos I'm trying to get rid of in the boxes and stuff. So hope you guys enjoyed. Leave a comment below. Hope you guys are all doing well. And I will see you in the next video. Peace.